Hi, Stephen Nicholas here. Thanks for joining me. I'm going to be speaking in this video about using this five sequence drying process in a coaching practice. And about half of that is how I work with this in my private practice and, and working with it, groups. The other half of this is really about promoting to you engaging with me on a, on a level beyond the individual practitioner and ways that you can use this process in, in your relationship with me as a way to build your coaching or psychotherapy practice and enhance your skills and basically support both of our interests in pursuing a more interesting career paths using this as a, as a foundation there. I've been working with this particular five sequence process, geez, I'm not sure, it's probably been nine or ten years. It developed out of several other drying processes, relational drying processes that I developed from the early 2000s forward. The most significant of, of those in some ways was this one because it doesn't require a partner. But in terms of impact on an individual's change work practices, there's their therapeutic goals and, and, that, and that kind of, of dimension, the, the, the single panel relational drying process, really powerful. And then there's another version of that that uses two panels, three panels, and then another one that I call the storybook process, which is similar other than it's framed a little bit more interestingly. And each of these different processes have a, a lot of impact on a person's internal emotional state and the therapeutic goals that they're bringing to the work. The other Part of that is there, it's a really useful set of techniques and I'm going to basically focus on the five sequence drawing process here to work with groups and sometimes those groups might be couples, sometimes those groups might be uh, individuals that you work with and you bring them together one or two times a month in a coaching setting having engaged them with the 30-day challenge inherent in this 10-minute-a-day for personal transformation program. All of those are opportunities for you as a, a coach who's got a different level of agreement with me, a different contract with me, to use that as a, as a money maker and a practice builder and a way to enhance your your personal skills, uh, professional skills. Many times, certainly w with, with, with families and small groups that I've done in educational kinds of settings, there's a lot of things to do after you've completed a drawing. W one of the great things with a family, for example, is I point out to especially when there's kids there, that the stories can change. I can go home, take my drawing, and I'm going to tell a different story about it, say, to my mother and father than I, I did to the young individual in my office. That I can get up and tell a story about your five panel that isn't even close to what your intentions were and, and where you were with it, just as a way to kind of open and challenge some of the, the rigidities of our patterns. And it's a lot of fun when you're with a family or a task group or a group that kind of interacts in educational settings to have different people in that group tell stories with it. I've used the storybook process and sent people out on treasure hunts, basically to find things, natural items from, from the environment outside of the group to help supplement, make a multimedia version of 
a series of, of these drawings in, in that process and then be able to share, share that at the end. So there's a tremendous amount of versatility in using these techniques in bringing people into a group. You've got two, four, five, six people that are somewhere involved in their 30-day challenge and you have them come in weekly, you know, twice in the 30 days perhaps. And you get to work through and have conversations with them about how's it going, where is it working for you, how, what are you noticing differently in your life, and, and then having the support of these other people. And it's a really energizing, powerful way to support their practice and, you know, charge some, some nominal fee of, you know, 10 to $50 a, a session for each group member, in addition to the workbook and the access to the website. Uh, basically, that would be a, a, you know, kind of a wholesale to retail situation where I would be wanting to sell the program to, to you at $100, and then you would sell it for $150. And then you would be able to do some additional kinds of work uh, the, the difference in, in my permissions for how you could use that would increase where you'd be able to use it formally in your practice. You would be able to use it with these individuals uh, at different times. Of course, I'd, I'd love to be invited out to do different kinds of trainings with your group of people. There's a lot of wonderful stuff, not so much just with this process, but if you're working with couples, for example, that is really, really powerful. Uh, a one day to a day and a half workshop. A lot of really useful, fascinating, powerful programs to, to involve uh, with you as an individual practitioner, with you as somebody who's developing or has developed a training enterprise and are already have a, a schedule of folks that you're working with. So a lot of really interesting opportunities. I hope you will give this some thought and I look forward to hearing from you if you have any more interest in this or any questions. So, so thanks for the time. Have a good day.